Hey everybody, it's Devin. Hey yeah, Billy. I'm gonna turn this machine here off. That's a dehydrator. Well, it was a pretty good summer, besides the forest fires and all that. And uh, my tray here for uh, my tailings is empty. So I got room in my tailings pond here. I also got a lot of material in the panning station here. So normally I uh, take the stuff in the bottom of the panning station and I just run through the high banker to uh, recover whatever's left in there. And this is the dirt I've collected over the summer to run over the winter. There's my jars of concentrates over here on the shelf to run. But before I do any of that, I got a whole bunch of magnetite I need to go through here from last summer. So we're going to bust out the magnetic separator and then uh, run this stuff through it and see what is magnetite and what is not. So that's what's on the menu for this adventure today. So I'm going to go over there and grab that machine, bring everything back here and set it up. Hopper here, and then here. So as I pan over here in my little panning station, I also uh, use one of these little fellows to pull whatever magnetite and I can get. And also, on the bottom of my sluice here, I got magnets that capture well, the magnetite. And as the magnetite stands up on edge, it traps the gold. So hopefully what's in here should have a little bit of gold in it. I forgot this much yet to go. This thing comes with uh, different size funnels. And I leave the small size funnel in there. And use that to dictate the feed rate. And I use a small little filter here, or, I don't know, kitchen strainer, I guess the mini one, to catch the material that would plug the funnel off. Looks like a little mini classifier, catches all the stuff. And a little tap, and let's see, to fill up the funnel. So my Nation River claim is infamous for black sand. Part of the reason why I justified this machine's existence. I should have been recording how much weight of gold I've recovered off the non-magnetic side. And it gives you an idea of uh, justification for spending money on such contraptions. Oh, 
Alrighty, we're down to way about half the way, maybe a bit more. When I'm at my Nation River claim, I uh, pan down my concentrates to the point where I see black sands and the first bit of gold contained within, and then I snuffer up everything and bring it home here to process. I think it's a more efficient way to do it. I'm really curious to see uh, what was recovered when we went up there on Halloween. Having to saw the beach out just to recover the dirt. That was pretty interesting. That was fun. I like those ones. Be a lot of work up there to rebuild that claim. Chop a lot of trees down. Size here, which we're going to stay to the very, very end. Got a bunch of empty containers here, which are going to be handy. Okay, I Tidy up. Keep everything really clean and newish. Oh, this stuff can go back into be ceramic. Goes back together. back in. Got our two pieces in place. Turn it on. And these are the They're non magnetic, that's it going through the second time. It's pretty much through sand. Oh, must have ran out of material. Oh. Well, I better put you guys back down up there and get to work here. Take care of all the non magnetic cans. This is everything I've caught in the magnets, and so there could be gold stepping and trapped in those dirt. So that's cool to see.
Curious to see what's going to be in this one we found. Hopefully, a little bit of gold. That'd be always nice. trickling in there instead of overwhelming it. Well, I should probably hit the brakes on this and get back to it once I uh, get down to the rest of this lifetime because we've still got all this to go through there yet. But it is doing a fine job, guys. And there's all the stuff that's gonna... I'll probably end up running this back through here one more time. But it could be gold in that. A little bit through there at a time, and that's that. You see the color contrast, though. Pull this 
guy out. Pour it into here. recovery so far. Not a huge pile, but a little something. I still have all this yet to, to run through. So I was only off about a third of it. So more panning yet to go and we'll see how it goes from there. Well, the bin is empty. A tiny little bit of gold in the pan. the machine justifies itself. That's all gold that would have been lost. Nice to now I'm recovering as much as I can with what equipment I have. 
Well, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I see you next week. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Do all the good things that help me out in the algorithm there. Uh, yeah. And if not, just squirrel this one away. Save it for later. Again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.